Hello, I'm Miss Broadfield and I'm the head of year 11 here at Harlington Upper School. This is a short video presentation just taking you through some key dates for you to be aware of for year 11 over the coming weeks and equally to update you on some of the changes to the qualification series in the summer 2022. Firstly, some information has been shared home with regards to the upcoming Year 11 Parents Evening. This is due to take place on the 4th of November and will be a virtual event. Appointments will be five minutes in length and will give you the opportunity for you to speak directly with your son or daughter subject staff. During the Parents Evening, the purpose of this evening is for you to talk about how they can make sure that they're ready for their mock exams in a few weeks time but equally you may wish to discuss some post 16 options in case they're interested in studying the subject further please do ensure that you read through all of the guides that have been provided and that you're aware of how to access the system before the parents evening takes place if you do have any questions please do not hesitate to get in touch Secondly, Year 11 are preparing for their mock exams in mid-November. These will take place between Monday the 22nd of November and Wednesday the 1st of December. A mock table has been attached to this week's newsletter so that students have an awareness of when their exams will take place. Individual timetables will be provided after the half term. We'll also speak with all the Year 11 students about how they can prepare, what they need to expect and what it's going to be like when they take these exams in the school. Please can you encourage the importance of their revision and starting their revision as soon as possible. While subject staff will guide them and give them advice on what things to prepare and some exam technique, we are also still in the middle of preparing them for their GCSEs and BTECs next summer. Therefore, in their lessons at the moment, we are focusing on covering subject specification content. So it's really important that they use their time wisely outside of lessons to prepare for these important mock exams. As we know, the mock exams are more important than ever in giving us an indication not only of what they may achieve next year, but also it's good practice for them in preparation for it. So please, can you encourage these same messages at home? Finally, there are some changes that have been made available to us at the school here with regards to the qualifications that your son or daughter will be sitting next summer. Due to the disruption in learning over the last few years, the exam boards are communicating with schools as to how they can adapt the examinations to ensure that those students are not hindered from getting the best grade possible at the end of the course. There are several changes that are happening to each individual subject. A link has been provided where you can see the most up-to-date information we've had provided from the examination boards. Please do be aware, be aware though that by the 7th of February, all exam boards do need to have communicated with the school as to if there are gonna be any further changes. So while some subjects may not have any changes at the moment, that is not to say that future changes may not occur. We are, of course, continuing to inform students and making sure that they are prepared for those exams. So please do not worry. If you do have any further questions, please do seek support from either the subject teacher, your child's tutor or with us here in the year office. I wish you all a lovely half term and thank you again. For